morning guys. I hope you guys are doing awesome. We've already had a pretty busy morning and I think Oliver's about to wake up from his nap. So apparently he's been doing this thing. He's already... Mom, you want to see what he's doing? Uh, well, he climbed out of his crib today for the first time. He wasn't mad. He just saw something that he really wanted that was outside of the crib. And so he basically climbed out to go get it. And then he knocked on the door to tell me that he was outside of his crib. So anyway, I put him back to bed and he went right to sleep. Yeah, I think it's time that Missy's going to have to look into the twin bed. Sooner than she was hoping, but obviously if he's going to be climbing out. So anyway, he's about to wake up. I thought, well, maybe I could catch it on film for Missy and Brian. Since they're not here, maybe we'll catch it, see what happens. He might do it, he might not. We'll see. So we're going to go set up the camera right now and hopefully we can catch it for everyone, for all you guys to see. Good morning, guys. Look. There's Brian and the ocean. We woke up this morning and totally just chilled in the room until we had our in-room massages. We just had like awesome massages. My hips were killing me so badly. Plus, whenever you like go snorkeling, it kind of does like... You use muscles. You use muscles, you know. definitely. And you're like tense and so um, we both got a really nice massage and it was really wonderful and my hips feel so much better. We're actually starving now. I gotta hop this fence. It's sprinkling here. It is. It's just a little it bit It actually sprinkling. rained and stormed last it's night. It's almost like a mist. It feels really nice. They have the best french fries ever here, you guys. They're like seasoned and yummy and crispy. I don't really like french fries, but these are seriously so good. Yeah. Missy and I are both eating chicken strips. Yes. <laughs> Food. Yeah, sometimes you just need a little slice of home and comfort mm -hmm. and they have really good chicken strips here too Which I'm pretty sure are on the kids menu yeah. <laughs> Hashtag no shame Kids Well, that didn't take long. That was like within 30 seconds of me of me putting the gun out of the thing. What are you doing, you crazy kid? <sighs> yeah, we're definitely gonna need to get him a twin bed sooner than we thought, huh, buddy? <laughs> so we are getting ready to maybe head into town and uh, have some fun exploring the city. But I, we showed this to you guys, but when we vlogged it, it was nighttime. And now it's daytime, so you can see it in all its beauty. This is a old rundown sugar mill. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it probably crushed like the sugar canes. So sugar cane actually used to be a really big export uh, for this place, but not really so much anymore. There's really only one place you can get it, and they do like make the sugar cane juice out of it. So now that they don't really do a whole lot of sugar cane, they have a lot of these sugar mills. Yeah, like everywhere. Yeah, we saw like two coming in on the boat. Yeah, you can see them on the map. They're like scattered all over the island. Yeah. Cool. It is pretty cool. Ooh, a shell. Ooh, a conch shell. Do you know how to do it? Hmm. <laughs> Are you trying? Kinda. Of. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Here, let me try. <laughs> So we don't, just don't know right? what to do. No. <laughs> so I was gonna yeah, think we're I, dying in here. <laughs> really, we'll just leave that <laughs> so it is very hot today. Look at this boy. <laughs> you look like a ghost. <laughs> he kind of looks like a ghost because I put sunscreen on his face. 
Everybody. Yep. <laughs> Wait, can you see that? It's like 108, 43 Celsius. We're gonna go in here for a little while. I just thought maybe we should take advantage of the pool time, so we're gonna yeah. go do that. Wait for Auntie. I think Coda wants to go now that too. Good. <laughs> Is it cold? What if you take the gun and he jumps to it? Jump to the gun. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. He always wants to play with the water gun, but we never fill it up with water unless we're outside or in the pool. Bring it inside. So we can't let him bring it inside. Yeah. With water. You want to shoot the gun? Yeah. Shoot it. Hold on. He's trying to catch it. He's trying to catch it. Yeah. We are in downtown St. Croix, walking toward the boardwalk. We're just gonna explore a little and then I think have dinner down here later, but this is the boardwalk area. The marina. The marina. This is a tsunami hazard zone. In case of earthquake, go to higher ground. Yeah. Because they have an earthquake here. and then a huge wave comes and crash the city. It's a cool little marina though. There's lots of chickens and cats running around. It's pretty cool. Oh hey, that was our boat. Yeah. And that's our crew. <laughs> hey Rudy! Uh, those are real giant fish. Holy <laughs> crap. They're hanging out here, they're gonna get eaten. He's like this big. <laughs> yeah. That is Look crazy. One thing you guys may not know about St. Croix that we learned after we were here, um, apparently it has the highest murder rate in the entire world. We've been told it's like locals only and it's because it's such a small area so we definitely have to keep our wits about us. Yeah, like they definitely are like, mm, if you're gonna go out, you need to go out during the daytime, stay, yeah. like be like really cautious and they're like kind of hesitant to A little hesitant leave. about it, but. They're like, you they're wanna like, leave the resort? We have everything here. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I wanna explore a little. Uh, so yeah, that's just something to keep in mind. But I think that's yeah. pretty much the end of the boardwalk. Yeah. So we can go this way now. One thing we do at every single place we visit is we get a magnet for our fridge. And we have not missed one place yet. Nope. Always gotten one. Always gotten one, so we gotta get one. I like the one with the turtles. Where? Or the Buck Island one. I do like the Buck Island one because we really went there. But it's there. just a picture, that's kind of boring. It is, but look how pretty it is. This is like the little shopping place we just went through. Look at it though, it's so cool looking. It's like weathered. Missy found a dog. That is an adorable dog. <laughs> Hi puppy. get a crucian hook. These are actually pretty interesting. This one's got this really cool gem in it, and it's like the gem of the Caribbean. Apparently this gem is only found in like the Caribbean. And Lorimer, I think it's a Lorimer yeah, gem. Okay. They said that it could increase value over time as they start to realize that it will actually is not found anywhere else. Oh, that's interesting. So the state crucian hook, I've been seeing a lot of people wear them out here. And I was like, what is this? And I finally found out it's just kind of like a symbol of like loving the island. Yeah. And um, it has a horseshoe for good luck. And then depending on which way you wear it, it means whether you're taken or not. So when the horseshoe is towards you, it means that you're taken, and if it's away from you, it means that you're looking for love. Um, Missy is not looking for love. Not looking for love. Ryan had to put it on me. That's part of the ritual. Yeah, it is cool. Here, chicka, chicka, chicka. But I'm just chilling. They don't like you. I used to be really good at this. There's an egg. Chickens. Oh my gosh, there is an egg. It's just an egg. Think there's anything in it? What if, what if it's alive? <gasps> the hell he found another dog. Bye, Mo. Bye, Mo. He 
It's like what I lack in legs, I make up for in love. <laughs> this place called Rum Runners grabbing dinner and we're right by the water so all these little crabs keep coming up. They're cute. It's scary but it's cool. <laughs> I don't want them to eat me. Look, there's a baby one. Oh, that is a little one. That's so funny. There's one over there. It's like this big. Yeah. It's probably on the menu too. <laughs> and he seems to be enjoying it. It's kind of weird, but look at him. He has no idea he's eating his cousin. A lobster. All right, here's another little piece. Let's see what he thinks. Wow. That time he was like, heck yeah, you're good. Oliver just went down for, for his bedtime. He went down super easy. There was no escape attempts, thank goodness. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. I'm gonna go ahead and end it. I got the two puppies in here. Say hi, guys. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Ow. Oh, jeez. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. We will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. All right, guys. We are sitting on the dock. We just got a dinner at the Rum Runner, and it was really, really good. And it's blurry. Okay. Smile. Okay. Now we're just waiting for our taxi driver to pick us up. But that was a ton of fun, just walking through yeah. the city and getting to like explore a little bit. And Yeah, the cool thing about St. Croix that I've figured out, there's really not a lot going on. We have our hotel, and it's lots to do, and there's fun stuff to do, but we don't feel like we need to go out and like do things. Yeah. Which was the point of the baby move, we should just be able to relax. Whereas relax. if we had gone to like, let's say Italy or somewhere else, like we'd be we like... We want to be exploring that city, like, we eating need to pasta go. at every place. And I wouldn't be able to, because I'm too pregnant, like I barely yeah. walk around here. Same St. Croix is a really great place to go to and just relax. Yeah. We needed a light because we kept losing focus. Ugh, that's horrible. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. We're gonna go ahead and end it here. That's Missy's armpit. <laughs> oh, that looks if you better. guys If you guys enjoyed today's vlog, be sure to click that thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel because we do this every single day. Thank you for watching and we'll see you manana. Look at that nice blurry sky. Ooh, okay, bye. Wherever you are, that's where I wanna be. All it